Yo, so what it is, you guys? Um, it is me here again, Dakota. You're, well, you're watching, but I have got news. Um, so I have. I don't know what the fuck it was, but. I was probably how I was doing this. Like, no shit. Um, I made a script. Let's see. I made a script. I made a script. I made a script. I made a script. It's like 12 pages long. Um, well, 12, almost 13 pages long. Um, uh, maybe a little more. But, I got some news about this next update to my channel. Um, yeah, so I've, you know, people, I'm not with nobody right now. Um, girl that I was with, she turned out to be just like using me to get, well, she just said, we're done, sorry, didn't give me no reason, she said because, no reason, but, she left me, but. Oh, R. Kelly. What's up about R. Kelly? Let's talk about R. Kelly. So, his daughter actually just spoke out on him. Joan Kelly, who guess by the name, goes by the name Baku Abi, posted a lengthy statement on her Instagram stories Thursday, which began Baku here. I just want to say a few things. Before, I just want it to be known that I am speaking from the heart not nothing I say or do say is to hurt any part any party reading this or affected by this the same reads to people that feel I should be speaking up or Last intelligence is off the charts just He's been having a very difficult time making so, everything that is going on right now, I just want to understand that is going on right now. I just want you all to understand that devastated is an understatement, understatement for all the all that I feel certainly. Our, our Kelly has come up under fire in the wake of a recent lifetime of schizophrenia series. Surviving R. Kelly which chronicles allegations of abuse, predatory behavior, and pedophilia against the singer. Um... I be apologized if my silence is all to all is that to all that is happening comes off as careless. This is my last sentence she wrote. I pray for all the families and women who have been affected by my father's action. Trust I have been def deeply affected by all of this. According to Abdi, she has been estranged from her father for a while she says 
I appreciate this, sir. Anyone that knows me personally or has been following me throughout the years knows that I do not have a relationship with my father, nor do I speak to him or his behalf. I also, I also am not fond of dealing with my personal issues or behavior, personal life through social media, but I feel things are starting to get out of, out of hand. She then went on to discuss how rem reminders of her, how terrible her father, my father is, and how we should be speaking up against him. Ride rude comics about my family, fabricate me, my siblings and our mother part, etc. Does not help my family. Me, my brother, my, my, my me, my sister, my brother, and my mother in our healing process. The same monster you all confronted, all confronting me about is my father, Abby wrote. I am well aware of who and what he is. I grew up in the household. She ended her statement by thanking her family's supporters to, for helping them through what she has been a difficult time. She says, family, friends, followers, fans, etc. I love you guys to pieces. Your love is appreciated and always will be. Um, I don't even know what he's done. I honestly don't know what he's done. Like, for real. Let me look it up. What has R. Kelly done? Twenty-two hours ago, his it showed that his career is going down finally crushing down 17 hours ago our county denies all sexual misconduct allegations bridges history Oh, lifetime this the co cursories filled as it what it is with claims of abuse and statutory rape date back about a quarter century at least. Beginning in the mid nineteen nineties and continuing through the present through the present day have been left out of sight of clarity. August 31st, 1994, Kelly, then 27 years old, marries Aaliyah, then 15. December 1st, 2000, 21st, 2000, Chicago Sun Times points the first allegation of sex with minors. February 8th, 2002, Chicago police reveal investigation into alleged child pornography. June 5th, 2002, Kelly indicted on 20 counts of child pornography. May 9, 2008, trial begins in Kelly's case in Chicago. June 13, 2008, Kelly is acquitted on all counts. Acquitted means they're done. They're just they're shut down. July 17, 2017. BuzzFeed published a story of women in Kelly's alleged sexual cult. July 23rd, 2018. Kelly releases 19 minute song, I Admit. October 4th, 2018. Kelly's ex-wife accuses him of physically abused.
January 3rd, 2019. Lifetime begins airing surviving R. Kelly. She was 18. She was 15 when he married her. I'm off of NPR.org. I'll actually leave the link in the description for it. Looks mad like shit, damn. Like, for real, like, he think. Oh my god. Okay. Chance the Rapper appears in the series final episode and apologizes for having worked with R. Kelly on multiple occasions. In recent years, despite the common knowledge of the accusations against the singer, after the series begins airing, Chance elaborates on Twitter, The truth is, any of us who ever ignored the R. Kelly stories or ever believed he was being set up, attacked by the system, as black men often are, were doing so... At the detriment of black women and girls, I apologize to all the survivors for working with him and for ta taking this long time, this long to speak up. Chance the Rapper said, The quote was taken out of context, but the truth is any of us who ever ignored the... Oh, shit. He was just saying that. Um... They have posters saying mute R. Kelly. Um, I was sick and... Fox says... CBS2 in Chicago reports that Fox says... Kim Fox, that the state's attorney of Cook County in Illinois, hold a press conference to ask possible victims of domestic violence or sexual assault by the senior to come forward. So that her office can start an investigation. CBS 2 in Chicago reports that Fox says to, of the series, I was sickened by the allegations. I was sickened as a survivor. I was sickened as a mother. I was sickened as a protester. Additionally, there was uncomfort confirms reports that Fulton County in Georgia is opening its own investigation. On January 29th, activists gathered outside Kelly's Chicago studio to protest the urge. Prosecutors to investigate the singer. Do you, do you, stay happy. Never let anybody tell you or make you want to or make you be somebody else. Because you are you and there's nobody else that can be a better you than you. Love y'all to death. Make sure y'all sh share the video. Comment what y'all think. Is it, is it true ac accusation or false accusation? Leave like, dislike. Like if you liked it, dislike if you didn't. Share it with people, and then tell them share it, and then tell them share it. It's the word on. Okay. Peace.